Hi guys, so it's me Emma and today it's me vlogging. Normally I don't do vlogs but today I am because my little baby boy Ethan is going to be born in this vlog which is really exciting. Mark and I are very excited. So I thought I would film a birth vlog because Jess, everyone loved Jess's birth vlog so I thought I'd do one too. I am having contractions at the moment but they're quite far apart, they're like 15 minutes apart. So it's far too early to go into the hospital yet. Um, but I'm really happy that I've started because I thought I wasn't going to start naturally. I thought I was going to need to be induced, which I didn't want. So I'm very happy that it started, even though it is very painful. And I'm just on my birthing ball right now. I hope you enjoy this vlog. Um, Ethan will definitely be here in this vlog. And without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, dearie me. So I just ran for a little story of what's been going on. So I started to get very light pains this morning and throughout the day they've been getting worse. And I phoned the midwife and she said because they're very far apart at the moment I have to stay at home and keep an eye on them from home. So Mark's just left to take Orla, who is our other daughter, around to my sister Jess's house. Um, Jess was supposed to have been at the birth of Ethan but unfortunately because of the global pandemic that's happening it isn't possible for her to be with me so she's going to look after Orla instead and I think Skip is going to help out as well so that's really kind of her but yeah I'm nearly 40 weeks pregnant now so I'm really lucky that I went into labour or I've started having contractions but I'm just keeping an eye on them bouncing on my birthing ball um, I think I'm going to take a bath as well because they said that helps with the pain I haven't had any pain relief yet obviously because the contractions aren't bad enough and they're not frequent enough but when i get to the hospital and stuff we will update you guys i don't know how good my husband be at vlogging because he doesn't like being in videos but we'll see what happens so i think i'm gonna go and take a bath right now and see if that will ease some of the pains oh Hi guys, so I haven't vlogged much for a while. I had my bath and it helped the pain a bit, um, but the contractions are starting to become more frequently. So I think I'm going to phone the hospital again and just see what they want me to do next. Ooh, ooh. Mark, Mark, can you come upstairs please? Hey, what's going on? What's the matter? You look in a bad way, Emma. Yeah, my contractions have started and they're very strong. Can you phone the midwife for me? I think it's time. Did they tell you to time them last time? How far apart are they now? Um, I checked the last one and it was about two minutes. Oh no, that's very, very close together. The baby's gonna be here. Oh no, oh no. Calm down, Mark. I'm the one giving birth, not you. All you have to do is be there and be supportive. Stop. Ooh, I'm having another one. Ooh. I'm sorry, Emma. I'm scared. I don't know what to do. Just phone the midwife. The phone's right there. Just grab it. You've got the easy part, Mark. <laughs> Come on. No, but I'm not as good at this as Ryan is. Don't worry, just phone them and tell them that the contractions are three minutes apart and then we'll ask them what they want us to do. All right. Hello there, is that maternity? Yes, my wife is in labor and she's giving birth. I think she's having contractions every, what did you say? Three minutes, Mark. Every three minutes and she's in a lot of pain and she said to phone this number. It's Emma. Emma Hogan. Yes, I know. I don't know what to do. I'm, I'm very scared right now. Yeah, she can breathe. She's doing breathing techniques, but I think she wants some pain relief. I don't know. Yeah, I do, Mark, but we have to go to hospital first. What should we do then? Okay, no problem. Yep, I'll get her there as soon as possible. Thank you very much. What did they say, Mark? They said I head right in right away. I'll grab the bags. Mark, I need to help me carry me to the car. You'll be fine. Just let me grab the bags. Oh, I wish he was more like Ryan. I'm scared right now. Ah! 
<laughs> we better go. There's a baby on its way. Oh. Hey, Mark, wait up. Oh, so, hi, everyone. Sorry if the lighting's awful, but we're now in the hospital. Um, my contractions are still quite strong, but I'm just sitting on my hospital bed and I'm waiting for a midwife to come in, aren't we, Mark? Yeah, I don't know how long it's going to take. Hopefully not too long. Yeah, so that's kind of what's happening. Um, hopefully soon. Oh, I can see her. Hello there. Is it Emma? Yeah, that's me. Hi, I'm midwife Barbie and I'm going to be delivering your baby today. Would you like, is it okay if I have a look at you? And just see how dilated you are and check on baby. Um, yeah, that's fine. I'm getting a contraction right now, but yeah, that's fine. So the first thing we're going to do is just have a listen to baby's heartbeat. That sounds perfect. And how are you feeling right now? Oh, well, the contractions are very strong and about two minutes apart. And I can sometimes breathe and everything. Okay, so, um, what pain relief have you tried? Um, I haven't had anything yet, have I, Mark? Uh, no, no, nothing yet. Um, but I think I'm going to want to have an epidural soon. Okay, well, it looks like you're four centimeters, so we can look at getting you an epidural soon. As soon as there is an anesthetist available, I will send him right through. Thank you so much. In the meantime, why don't you jump, go on your birthing ball and just try to keep active because the more active you are, the more it brings baby down. Okay, thank you so much. It'll be okay, Emma. I know Mark is just really strong. It's fine. I'll, I'll go and grab some food. Do you want anything? No, you're fine, Mark. Okay. Hey everyone, so it's been about four hours, I want to say, since we last filmed anything. Mark had some tacos, so he's full, and I'm still in labour, um, but I've had an epidural now, which kind of means you have to stay in the bed more, but it's really helped with the pain. The contractions are a lot less painful. I think I'm about seven or eight centimetres now, which is really good. Um, I'm sorry I haven't been filming as much as Jess did in her birth vlog. She's just way better at this than me, and... I've had quite um, a painful experience, but um, I've had my epidural now and I'm just sitting on the bed waiting really to be 10 centimeters, but I don't know if I'm gonna have a nap or something before I have to start pushing. Um, baby Ethan is doing well for anyone wondering, um, so it hasn't been too complicated with him, which I'm very grateful for. Um, so yeah, that's kind of all what's happening, isn't it, Mark? Yeah, I think I'm gonna get some sleep, I'm tired. You're tired. I'm the one having the baby. I know, baby. So, yeah, that's kind of what's happening. But I'll try and update you guys when I'm pushing or after he's here. Because I don't really feel like filming much right now. <coughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness, Mark. Oh, my God, my son. My son is here. Congratulations. Oh my god. <coughs> okay, so this is your baby boy. I'm just going to weigh him. He weighs seven pounds, which is a really good weight. And I'm going to wrap him up in a swaddle. And if you like, sir, you can cut the cord. Of course, that would be incredible. Hello, Ethan. <coughs> okay, and we just need to give Emma some stitches. And then you can hold the baby. There we go, Ethan. You're all swaddled. You look beautiful now. I'm so happy with him, Emma. Well done. Thank you so much. I can't wait for Ola to meet him. Yeah, me too. Hi, Ethan, my beautiful boy. Welcome to the family. <coughs> You're so perfect. I can't wait for you to meet your sister. <coughs> Okay, everyone, so this is little Ethan, and we hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to come back to our channel for another video very soon where we will be taking him home, and Jess is going to get to meet him. And all of, of course, we're very excited for your sister to meet you, Ethan. But um, we hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, leave a thumbs up. Make sure to subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you guys soon. Bye.